Hey, you orange one here. So we're back at uh, the silver stilts, or six day stilts. I don't know why I said silver stilts there. Um, so I did figure out this book. Basically, uh, for Iron Shanks, what they said was online, I, I read they basically said you can make gel by getting desalination tablets and um, combining that with slime, which makes gel. And we need one dram of gel and one dram of blood every day until the leg joints regain full motion. And so I, I spent a while just going to traders and looking at their inventory. I couldn't find desalination tablets. They're pretty rare. But I did find someone who can sell gel. I've forgotten which store it was. But one of these stores here, somewhere around the six day stilts, um, sells like, they're like an apothecary or something, and they sell some gel. And so what we can do is we can combine that gel with blood in a one to one ratio. So I'm going to take three of this gel and we're going to pour that into, um, This, wait, hold on. Did I do that right? So we're taking this, we're pouring into another container. Water skin, no, do not empty it out. And I wanna add three, because it does need to be at a one to one ratio. So now we've got six doses of this. So if we drink that, and then we look here, the pain in your joints subsides. Um. I forgot to actually check our pain in our joints, but if we look here at effects, it's actually gone down. I think it was like 30 something. So yeah, that's one way that you can uh, deal with these in infections is if you look, find a um, apothecary or whatever you need around here, you can trade for the ingredients. For me. Blood is not going to be an issue because we actually use blood or bleeding damage quite a bit in combat, so we'll get more blood. Um, I think it was exotic liquid liquids, wasn't it? Yeah, see, they've got they've got gel. I'm actually just going to buy some more gel. I think. Yeah, let's do that, and we'll actually get another glass bottle, which is not a half bad thing either. Trade complete. Sounds good to me. And actually, we're carrying too much now. Um, oh, we also have our our honey backpack. Um, we could get rid of some of our excess weight. Or we could just get rid of some of the extra water that we're carrying around. Hmm, what do I want to do? I mean, it'd be nice to have these EMP grenades craftable. Let's go for it. We'll disassemble two of these. And no, they didn't work. Oh, man. Um, we need to disassemble one more. We didn't get any more grenade recipes, but we can walk around. That's good. So what we can do is we can go on the over map until it's the 12th, come down, and then drink more of our blood gel concoction. Mmm, metallic taste. Wait, hold on, did that not give us our thing. Oh, maybe it hadn't been 24 hours. Let's go to the 13th. We'll try that. And hopefully this actually gives us what we're trying to go for. Is that not applying the effect? I think it is. I'm just not seeing it for some reason. 
Um. Oh wait, what? Is that what I think it is? Yeah. There's a Berithumite legendary. Oh, and there's actually some junk around here, so we could uh, we could pick through the junk. You know, I'm kind of done with micromanaging my weight for now. Let's go ahead and equip that. And the, no, not the flowing glow sphere, the hover sled. There we go. So I'm just going to gather some junk and see if we can talk to this dude. Oh, we need oil. Hmm. Gyrocopter backpack. <laughs> we could actually build one of those. Hmm. Interesting. So if we activate that, that could make us fly. Oh man, that sounds really cool actually. I need to get some oil so I can I can trade with this dude. So I need to go kill some robots or something. Maybe if I go into some ruins, I could probably find some robots to uh, to take out. I'm just gonna gather some of this junk for now. Wait, what? We got a ton of water. Oh, cool. We got uh, actually random bit of information there. So actually, you know, this right here seems to be a pretty good uh, pretty good skill for us. You know what I also was thinking about doing? A slime bog? Ooh, that does not sound like a place I want to go. I was thinking about looking at some of the procedurally generated parts of the game. And also, I don't know, I was also looking at maybe going to Bethesda Susa because I actually... Oh, I forgot to even talk about this. Ooh, look, a legendary glow pad. So I forgot to talk about this, but um, we got the ability. I um, found a chain gun uh, at a merchant that I bought, not knowing that it was a chain gun. And then I disassembled it because I was mad and I just wanted the, um, the loot. And I made a ton of those and uh, made the whatchamacallit, the mechanists, uh, mechanimists, actually friendly with us. So they will, um, they'll let me into their holy places, which is good because Bethesda Seuss is, is one of their holy places. Um, let's go ahead and just take a minute to make a camp. And then... I don't want to use up my honey right now because we actually don't have that much honey. Sure. I think my primary goal is uh, to just get rid of our disease. So if it's the 14th. Oh, look, there's a. Oh, these guys are attacking us. That's a bummer. I wanted to take more medicine. I kind of want to just take care of that because um, I know I'm going to forget to if I don't just do it until we're done with this. Okay, I think we need another two days. So it's just... Oh, we got more combat, really. Okay. Well, I'm fine with, you know, a little bit of combat because... I just actually want to get a, um, I just want to get some of this trash, I'm honest. And then there's actually a, another slime bog, really. There's a little village, um, I visited it a little bit actually by mistake on our way to, uh, to the six day stilt. There's like a little village just down here. Why are these guys not shooting me? 
they out of bullets or something? Oh, and also, yeah, our night visions ran out of battery power, but I'm okay with that. Oh, is this the slime bogs they were talking about? I think it is. Okay. More trash. Is there any dungeons near us? <laughs> if I look over here, what is this? Bela and Apar. Why don't we just check out these places? So this was the place that I've actually already been to. And there's a Droma trader here. They've got some decent stuff. They've got some... Ooh! Small engraved stone. I'm curious. Should I buy it? I want to buy it. Oh, and the reason I haven't sold the books is because I'm thinking I'll save that for now and we'll get it later. Um... I don't know. I want to know what it is, but I don't know if it's worth it. I kind of feel like this card isn't even worth it because we can just blow our way into a lot of places with our grenades. The grenades just do destroy things. I'm doing it. I just am curious. My curiosity got the better of me. Oh, it's a grit gate rec What? I have a Grit Gate Recoiler. How can you not recognize a Grit Gate Recoiler, man? One Opa. Let's get rid of some of this junk. And if we go in here, let's see. Where's your leader? He's in one of the huts around here somewhere. Oh, there's also this little shrine over here, but we over we've already looked at it. Here we go. There's their leader. Um, let's see. What do you have to trade? Do you have anything? Nope, just bullets. Uh, can I look at you? Are you hated by anyone? Oh yeah, I kind of wanted to go to Bela, so I'm not gonna water. It's uh, one of our quests now. It is the still the 14th, but we are actually hungry. I'm just going to whip up just a regular meal. I'm not looking to waste our supplies right now. If I go down Ides, is that like a day? <gasps> Forgotten Runes! Ooh, look at that! Okay, that was actually just what I wanted. Uh, we'll drink that, and oh look, we're pretty much done with iron shanks. Um, I'm going to actually just go ahead and make a camp really quick before we go into these ruins. Um, we're gonna use a recipe. I've marked these as my favorites. I'm not sure why, but. Yeah, you can favorite recipes. Ooh, that looks pretty good. That's probably why I favorited it, because it's a good recipe. Some good abilities. So here's my problem, is that I want to go in ruins, but I'm going to lose track of the time. 
And I'm not sure how this all works. So if I look at that, oh look, uh, a book. Just lay in there. Sure. Should we read them? Let's just take a minute to look at the books that we have. If you're curious. Um, you can read through it at your own pace. I'm not going to read through it. Personally. At least not right now. This is interesting. Huh. Okay. I just got interested by the, um... Sorry, I went back there. By the format of that one page. Wait, what? Wait, we can make special things? Like potions and stuff? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Wow. Oh, those are actual recipes I got from reading it. Interesting. You know, I saw that the cooks at a um, at one of the stores at the Six Day Stilts had um, some books like that. Oh, that's asphalt. I don't want to go in there. For a minute, I thought it was oil. Too bad there's not an oil weep. Oh. Some blood right there now. <laughs> okay, there we go. Um, yeah, I kind of want to just go into this room to get rid of this music. That looks like fresh water. Oh, look. Sure, I'm gonna pick that up, actually. Nothing? Okay. Well, we checked it out. What about this place right here? I don't want to cook, I want to go down onto the map. That bar. Oh, I'm cured of iron shanks. I didn't even have to take another thing. Oh, wait, what's this? Ogre... Ape meat. Can I take that? What was it called? Oh, oh, it's a pelt. Um, that's probably not worth that much. It's gonna drop both of those. So that's nice that we're cured of our disease. I kind of want to get some oil to talk to that one robot dude. We didn't actually need to buy that other gel. Hey, we got more history about a sultan. What are you? Trash monk? Ooh, you got a weird artifact. I bet that's a grenade. It's either a grenade or possibly a laser weapon. <clears throat> oh no, they cleaved through my armor! Oh man! I think that makes the armor worse, doesn't it? Uh, oh. It's not. Not making it visibly worse than I'm aware of. I thought it did though. Oh, is it unbreakable? Maybe that's because why it's not getting worse. Oh wait, no, they cracked my shoes! Is there a way to repair that? Please tell me there's a way to repair these. Yes. Yep. 
That was good to me. Can't believe it. Oh, what's this? Glass bottle. Ooh! Yes, I will take the glass bottle of oil. And... This other glass bottle, sure. Sorry, Hermit. I'm sure those are yours. And that you would not be happy about us taking them. Should I be a murder hobo and kill the trash monk? He's got a short bow, so I'm pretty sure it's just a grenade. Now I'm curious, I just want to see what's in here. Oh look, there's a weapon rack there. And I think that we're good. I think that one dude was like around here somewhere, but I'm not sure where. Wait, what? What are you? Salt Kraken? I don't want to mess with that by the looks of it. That looks like a, a tough one. Okay, we've regained our bearings. I think I was higher up. I think I might have been like one more up. We saw it. Yep. There you are. Can I uh, water ritual you? He's not hated by anyone. Sure, give him some oil. Okay. <laughs> we can make an electro bow or a hologram bracelet, both of which are pretty good. Um. Oh, what? We could just ask him to join us, and he's actually only got 50 reputation for his cost. Hologram bracelet sounds kind of nice. And we've got such a high reputation with the Earth Mites, I feel like going for the hologram bracelet and having him join me is fine. Sure, yeah. And, yeah, why don't we have you join us? 07? I'm gonna nickname you Bond. Wait, does your whole crew come with us? Um, we could trade with him. Is he just gonna carry this stuff around with him? Is that how that works? Oh, wait! All this is- <gasps> It's free. Oh my god. I think I just found a huge exploit. But his is mine. Right? How is this even a thing in game? Yep. I'll take all of your stuff. And... We're so overpowered now. Um... Let's just learn to make all this stuff. Um, and then... The Force Bracelet and the Hogam Bracelet together could be a pretty deadly combo. We could probably put that on our left arm. I don't think we need it though... with us right now. And that is actually, blaze injectors are not half bad. Not be frozen. Cold resistance, that's actually gotta be really nice for where we're going next. And it gives us quickness. Um, do we have all the, we don't have a nanomaterial, but we could get one. Oh, it runs on oil. Ha 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 
I just kind of want to play with it just to see how it works, but we're going to need more oil. Or else it might kill us. So we could, like, fall. Um... Hologram bracelet. Ooh. Hologram bracelet and gyrocopter backpack are not going to be compatible. Because we don't have enough pristine electronics, basically. Hmm. Unless we have something we could disassemble for pristine electronics. I mean, the sniper rifle we could disassemble, but I don't want to. disassemble this and now we've got the nano material for the gyroscopic backpack so we've got a gyroscopic backpack now and I fill it with our one thing of oil Do we have that one thing of oil I don't see the oil that we, we had. Okay, well, we don't even have oil for it. That's kind of cool. We'll play around with it later on. I can't believe that we've got this dude following us and he's got his whole posse following him. And these guys actually... Ooh, we can just take all their stuff. <laughs> okay. Nice book there, buddy. If they'll come with me, I'm just curious if I go on the overmap and down. There they are. Wait, what? Yeah, this whole group is, uh, we're rolling deep. I'm gonna go to the, the stilts. And... Guys, please don't bleed out on the bushes. Are you gonna fight? Are they fighting? Oh no! I think they're totally fighting. Not good. Not good at all. Oh no, our friends. Please come with. Please stop fighting them. Before you all die. Is that the uh, the dudes are following us? They're totally killing all my bear, my friends. No. You guys keep on running. That was brutal. Okay, well we can't go back to the six day still unless we're willing to have this whole group die. Man, that's so upsetting. Those me mechanists just killed like three bears and a couple robots too. Well, we should probably use these guys while they're still with us. And they're not dead, you know? Um, why don't we look at the map and we can identify some place to go to. What if we go to... Um, wasn't there a quest that we got? Maybe we could go to that basket. Yeah, I have no idea where that is.
I don't think we know the location of that place, the hearth. But maybe we do. That's a different hearth. Oh, here we go. If I hit that, then the hearth actually shows up over here. Okay. Let's go to the hearth and put something in it. My friends, yeah, my friends are here. Good, they didn't all die. So they make like a little pilgrimage to here or something. But where? Where's the woven basket in here? Is it in here? Maybe in this little room? Nope. It's nice that the star apple fa farmer doesn't mind me just coming in and stealing all their stuff. You know, it was it was worth the um, reputation expense that we got just to get those recipes that we we got from the robot. Definitely feel like it was an ex exploit, but. I'm not going to complain too much, you know. They said there was some sort of basket. Must be just not seeing it. Where are you guys over here? Oh, the apple farmer's daughter. Oh, we fell in love with the daughter. Love sick. Is that like that better not be a permanent effect? Hopefully we get over Oh look, there's the basket. So what do I want to put in there? What would they accept? I mean they've got it in there. Some petals, some cider. Will they take anything? Can I, um, what's the... No, I don't want to pick up the basket. If I go over it, can I drop that in it? Will that work? No. Um... Oh, F2 to store an item. Or plus. Plus. Uh, what if I put... Do I want to be cheap and just give them something like useless? A uh, file of acid or something? I might deeply offend them. Give them some kudzu stems. Yep. Worth it. Totally worth it. Let's go back to that village. We're still left sick. Oh man. I'm gonna be upset if that effect stays with us for forever. It's a good one as well. The Dromad's over there, but I don't want to talk to the Dromad, I want to talk to you. Yep. Ooh, we got a reward. Forgotten Ruins Recoiler. Data disk, data disk, data disk. I feel like those are books. Let's go with data disk. Ooh, ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. a high powered magnet. I don't have any sixes. That sounds pretty interesting. I 
I have no idea how I would use that. <laughs> Rolling chair. <laughs> I don't know why I would ever need that, but okay. How long have I been recording for? Okay, so that looks like a good point to end this episode. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One. <laughs>